Today, we will see the cut report trading strategy. Hello, this is Igor from FX Igor YouTube channel. And yesterday, I created one video, how to read a cut report. And today, I will show you how you can create very simple cut report trading strategy. So, let me diving in. Like I said yesterday, you can go to the website tradingster.com slash cut because here you will get not simple cut report with bunch of numbers you will get a beautiful chart and that chart can help you to have excellent cut report visual representation the cut report trading strategy that today i will show is very boring but can be very beneficial so the steps are simple first you open major forex index cut reports for example cut report per us dollar euro dollar aussie dollar kiwi dollar british pound etc etc uh, like i said the cut reports for are for indexes so it will be only for us only for euro only for aussie only for kiwi so there is no cross currency crosses so there will not be euro dollar it be only dollar or only euro then you will find the potential reversal points of the cut chart then you will open daily chart for major forex pairs you will add 100 200 moving average of the daily charts we'll talk about later and you will define the weak currency and strong currency and your goal is to buy strong currency slash weak currency for example, if the euro strong and dollar weak, you will buy euro dollar. If the euro is weak and the dollar is strong, you will sell euro dollar. And the previous low high will be stop loss. So we will we, we will see that in practical examples. So like I said yesterday, what you can do when you open a cut report is to find the spots on the chart when the gray and blue line are either cross each other or the difference between the, commer the commercial and non-commercial traders are the biggest so you see if the blue line and gray line cross i put a red line if we see the maximum distance between the commercial and non-commercial between the green the gray and the blue line you will see the vertical red line so you can do this this strategy you will apply maybe two times per year for some currency pairs so you will not do this very very often but one per month or a couple months you can do this strategy and can really be beneficial and you will have a feeling about the major trend like i said this is the first step that you need to do so you can do and you should do this for a lot of cut reports you can do that for stocks cut reports for uh, metals cut reports currencies etc etc sometimes you're surprised what you can see on cut reports and how sometimes the market is predictable when i say predictable not the future price you can predict the future reversal that can be much much beneficial for you i will show how so like i said from the yesterday this is the cut report for us dollar you can see that in the last year in 2022 between the june july it was the 14 june I, I think we had the biggest distance between commercial non-commercial trades so i put a red vertical line as you can see couple months from then we saw the maximum us dollar so when you find the 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 interesting spot that, that doesn't mean that tomorrow and the next week we will have reversal reversal will happen in next few months so you need to be patient so when you find reversal remember reversal can happen next week but for sure maybe 90 80 percent sure we can see that in next three to six months and for us dollar we could see that we expect the weak US dollar in the in the second half of the 2022 as you can see that bearish trend for US dollar is actual right now so the end of the 2022 and the whole 2023 year is in the bearish mode for US dollar of course there is a lot of fundamental talk about that but I don't want to talk about that right now this is the euro dollar cut report as you can see in the September last year 2022 we had a uh, biggest distance we have the smallest distance between the dealer between the with the dealers and the commercial non-commercial trades 
And what's happened then is that from that moment, it was the maybe a month after that, we had a minimum price for, for euro, euro. And then from that moment, euro started to go in bullish trend. So what we can say is from the, the end of the 2022, we have the bullish trend for euro and as I said, a bearish trend for US dollar. So the next thing that you should watch and, ch and the check is how long this bullish or bearish trend for some currency or from some asset can last. What I want to check is asset managers. And you can see on Trendister uh, this chart. It's just above the cut report. It's a part of the cut report. What you want to see is, is it this 60, 40, 70, 30, 80, 20, 90, 10? What is the ratio of the long and short trades? What they want to see is that it's not 100% to zero, you know. I want to see that, there, that this trend, if right now, for example, right now, this is the May 2023, and this, is the euro and US dollar cut report and uh, the ratio of the short and long trades. You can see for euro and for US dollar, there is a room for this trend continuation. So in the May 2023, what I can see is that US dollar can decline more. And what I know right now is that euro can rise more. So this is the good thing for all traders that if you right now you have euro dollar buy trade you should not close this trade because there is an opportunity that this trade will last maybe couple months and this is the good good news even for some traders that want to open a euro dollar buy trade this information beneficial because we see that there is a room for potential bullish trend for euro dollar now we will watch the chart as you can see in december 2022 we had a reversal on the chart this is the this is the euro currency index chart and on the us dollar chart we have reversal in the bearish trend so what we have right now on the these charts if you see you see the bullish reversal for euro dollar we see the bullish trend for euro dollar and the bearish trend for us and we have a strong and weak currency strong currencies euro weak currencies dollar so euro dollar we can go bullish trend but this is the double strong bullish trend because you have a bullish trend from the strong dollar and i have a bullish trend for weak dollar and because of that we have a strong euro dollar bullish trend and you can see it it was like that from the 0 0.1.0 or 1.002 we went somewhere of a 600 pips and and more maybe 800 pips during the next six months and the traders who enter um in the winter into buy euro dollar trade they could they could achieve maybe 800 or 700 or 600 pips profit so i will again talk about this strategy this is the goal of this strategy is to spot the strong currency, to spot the weak currency. But the strong currency is not just on the chart. We need to watch and cut report and to see the will this trend will last. Are we in bullish trend for that currency or not? And everything need to match. We need to match a price on the chart. We need to see the cut report to match and we need to confirm with long short trades ratio and everything is okay we can be happy i said that i put the 100 or 200 moving average on daily charts sometimes i will put 100 and sometimes i will put 200 how i choose i choose to see will that moving average will match the trend you know if 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 that for example last eight months simple moving average 100 just bring the bullish trend and all prices are above that trend, 
I'm sure that this is good. And if I see that 200 is maybe more suitable, I will put 200. Usually I put 200 moving average because this, this number and this indicator is very good for bullish bearish trend, but sometimes I put 100. Like I said, this is again dollar index. And we know that in December we had a starting of the bearish trend. Like I said, the dollar price started to went down, even the extreme was in the June. This is the gold cut report. The gold cut report is uh, as same as uh, other cut reports, just the the name, the names are different. So you will see the swap and money and money managers. So what it mean is the swap, the swap and the money managers, the swap is SMS non-commercial trades and uh, money managers are institutional trades. So this is, there, there's no difference here. And uh, you just need to watch uh, a green and the blue line on the chart to see are there extreme or crossover. And as you can see in the October, we started to see uh, the crossover between the money, the money and the swap. And after that, we just a couple weeks after that, maybe the same week, we we can we can see the bullish trend for gold. So gold is in the bullish trend. So gold is in the bullish. And on the other side, the U.S. dollar is in the bearish trend. So the gold asset, because the gold, as you know, asset is a um, gold slash U.S. dollar. So it's a more and stronger bullish trend, as you can see. From the November 2022, the price was uh, uh, 1640, so 1640. And uh, uh, in the May, we got uh, 2036. So if you can see, it's a huge, it's a huge bullish trend. It's a huge bullish trend. It's more than more than 40 percent, as I see. So it's it's a, it's a really really maybe thirty percent okay. So it's a, it's a really really strong bullish trend, and uh, and you can see how cut report can help you to see is it is this weak strong currency is good good way to achieve and enter into trade. Uh, I just want to make one very important notice. Uh, as I know a lot of traders will say okay. I can watch strong currency on the chart, weak currency on the chart, and then I can just make strong weak currency pair and the trade. I don't need cut report. I want to tell you one thing. The cut report is important because the cut report can tell you will that trend is real and can that trend last? Because maybe you enter into trade strong weak currency maybe you buy strong currency against the weak currency you are happy but maybe just that moment is the reversal point and you lose all your money or you create a very stupid trade so in that case the cut report is excellent tool to check where we are now will this trade last etc so i hope that cut report strategy for reversal points are good strategy for you you can make a lot of strategies because in any, every kind of long position strategy you can make combination and add cut report because cut report can be only one additional trigger that can help you to enter into trade this is all i wish you a great day and bye bye